Would you stand just for a second? I, I got to... Where did, where did you get Ooh. those? Why? Oh, did you, did you, have, you must have had, what? you had breast implants, right? No, these are um, silicone injections, which is totally different from the implants. If you look... Probably you, more dangerous than implants. No, but. to be honest, see, that's what some people don't understand. Now, everyone's body chemistry is different. Some people can accept it and some people can't. I so have and could, so I have $4,500 put in it. But this was within a five-year process. This is, they put a little, you massage it so it keeps it nice and soft, and you keep going every six months till it gets to the size you want. These are 44Ds. They're soft. I have men that actually come there, look at it, they say these are the most perfect breasts that they've ever seen because they're very soft. It falls beautifully, and they're not like implants if you're lying down. Yeah. They're in the air. What do you do it? I mean, falls. do they want, what do they, do they want, <laughs> what do they say, like, I'll have the combo? I mean, what do they want? Do they want the, <laughs> what do they, what do they want? So you're working on one, I says, would you please work on the other one, because the other one needs a little attention. But I mean, the rest of you, what, are, what do you do? What do they ask you for? Well. Majority, because I work for an escort service, they know what they're coming and they know what they're getting. Now, the reason why I charge a lot for my escort service is because the illusion is more or less more of a woman than they would think like, like a trans. How much do you charge? <laughs> well, I mean, what, what, it's like between two to five hundred. Depending on what? If I go to out of town, it's more than that. It depends what they want. Because some of them what want they to bring want their that would wife. Cost $500? What would cost five hundred? What did you just say? In case they want to bring their wife along or their girlfriend along. Oh. Oh. Some people might think it's bad, but let me tell you, some of you women would do anything for your husband, regardless. You might say not here, but that doesn't. Matter. <laughs> yeah. well, I would have needed a wife. Yes, husband. Michelle. Yes, everyone let me tell you something. A lot of the guys always say they will never go out for transsexual. The first one always to go. Because mm -hmm. I've had, if I would mention just a few names, this whole audience would probably drop dead if they found out who the people You have some famous clients, don't you? The most famous. And I've even had the inquirer call me up and tell me, we heard you had so-and-so, so-and-so. And I said, I really don't know what you're talking about. It's the reason why you have to keep that very confidential. Even like when certain um, sports figure comes over, you know, they have to yeah, be very careful when they come in, you know. <laughs> What I love to get in these stars. I've had models. I've had um, God judges. Anybody but the thing is, they're mostly about. they're mostly straight men, right? But the reason why, right here, is you see the illusion of a woman. Yeah. We just have that little extra something that they're looking for. Let me just see. I, I want to see how honest this. Because I think I'm a pretty honest person. Do I bring it out in the eyes? Any man in here? I'm not saying would you actually do it, but wouldn't you kind of? Think of, would you think about going with one of these women? Anybody at all? None will stay right uh, here. Be honest. Can you be honest? Stay right here. Even who's even curious about it? Come here for a minute. Come here. Come here. Is this your? Yeah. Is this your? Is this your wife? Is this your wife? That's a pretty good one. Okay. Now look at this guy. Could this guy be one of your clients? I know. You who get paid to turn other people on.